Hi, I am Ali Ahmed. In this video, I am really excited to talk to you about vCenter upgrade uh, troubleshooting techniques. So, let's get started. So, to troubleshoot effectively your vCenter server uh, upgrade, you really need to understand the different phases involved in upgrade and you also really need to understand that each and at each and every stage your upgrade might fail. So we already have gone through several videos, we understand uh, each phase in detail. So now let's say if at any stage your upgrade fails, where should you start? Which log you should uh, actually look for first? So to understand that, we really need to understand uh, the logs and at what time th uh, those logs are getting created. So as we can see our, our upgrade process is start with the first phase which is uh, pre-install check phase. At this phase we will see there will be uh, two logs uh, getting generated. One is a VC install dot log which is vCenter server installer log and the second one is v VIM VCS hyphen MSI dot log which will be generated by uh, Windows uh, installer. So these logs are starting at, at very first stage and they will last till the end of the upgrade process. So for the sake of our understanding, we will call it first level log analysis. In, in uh, install start stage, there is no any other log. Verify packages stage, there is no any other log. At export stage, we can see there are uh, logs that is getting created for each and every component which is being exported. So let's say if there is a problem with any component, you uh, will see first uh, VM install log and you will understand which component is getting failed and then you will go and find out that component specific export log. That will really help you to isolate the issue. So for the sake of our understanding, we will call these uh, logs second level analysis log. The next phase is uninstall phase, where we can see there will be another second uh, le um, level log will get created for each and every MSI packages which is getting uninstalled. So let's say if there is any package that is not uh, being uninstalled properly, you will find that uh, package name here in vm install.log or in v vim vcs msi.log and if you take that component name and come to uh, this log and and search in this log you will be able to isolate the issue because this log will give you uh, sufficient information to isolate that problem so the next stage is a write setting stage. At this stage, we don't see any uh, secondary level log and same goes with load packages stage. We don't see any second level log created uh, at this stage. So if there is no second level log created at this stage, then we know that uh, all the information required to troubleshoot at this stage, we will be able to find in vm install.log or in vm vcs msi.log. So the next stage is install packages stage. We know at this stage installer is going to install packages. At this stage, we see there will be second level log created uh, that is known as package manager hyphen conf hyphen msi dot log. And this uh, log will uh, last till install uh, packages stage only. So let's say if there is any package which is not getting installed, you will uh, get that information in vm install dot log and you need to find out that MSI package name and look into the package manager hyphen conf hyphen MSI dot log. This log will give you sufficient information to isolate the problem. The next stage is configure packages stage. We also know this stage as first boot stage. We know that at this stage, there will be secondary level logs for each and every component which is being configured at this stage. So if there is same goes with this, if there is any problem with any, any component which is not uh, getting configured properly, you will get, get a clue in vm install.log and find out, uh, get the name of that component and search in search for that component first boot uh, the, uh, hyphen py dot log, you will be able to uh, isolate the issue by looking into this log. So the next stage is 
uh, import uh, stage at this stage also we can see for each and every component which is being imported there will be import uh, log created for 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 them and uh, if there is something goes wrong with that component or any component that is not being imported properly you will get uh, you know a clue in vm install dot log and and same in v, vim vcs hyphen msi dot log and then you need to find out that component and come to the uh, import uh, dot log for that component and you will be able to isolate the issue uh, properly finally install n uh, stage at this stage we know that there is no secondary level log getting created so if something goes wrong with this stage you will be able to isolate the issue by looking into vm install dot log or vim uh, hyphen vcs hyphen msi dot log so that was pretty much about vcenter server upgrade log workflow at this point we understand different logs we also know at which stage these logs are getting created now the next question is how can we identify at which stage our upgrade is failing well by looking at the installer screen we can identify at which stage our installer uh, our upgrade is failing but what if somebody is sending you log bundles in next video let's do vcenter server upgrade troubleshooting based on log bundle thank you